Welcome, in front of me is a Samsung Galaxy A55 and today I'll show you how you can enable and set up your do not disturb mode. So to get started, pull down your notifications by swiping down from the top of your screen and then swipe down once again to extend the list of visible toggles. Now on one of the pages you should have a do not disturb toggle visible which for me it's basically the last one right here but if you don't see it on the first page go to swipe to the left and this will show you additional page in any case once you see this toggle you want to hold it the first time around and then select details which will take you to the settings and in here you can customize how the mode will actually function once enabled now starting off i'm gonna only touch upon a couple of the options right here not all of them but you can obviously go through all of them yourself so Starting off we have for how long which defines what happens when you press on the toggle. I personally like to select it on a timer and make it a little bit uh, longer time frame. And this allows me to basically have the luxury of forgetting that the mode is enabled. And when I do so, the phone will turn it off for me after the specified amount of hours. Pretty handy. Otherwise, your do not disturb mode would be running indefinitely. Below that we have schedules which allows you to select a fully automatic schedule. Uh, so days of the week, start and end time. And if you're planning to use a schedule, just make sure that it is toggled on in here and that's all you would need to do. The device will do everything else for you. Now additionally, you can create new schedules and have multiple ones with different days of the week, different time frames, completely up to you. And scrolling down, we have calls and messages and here you can select you can call you or message you with a difference for calls. Calls have this toggle allow repeated callers. So if someone calls you twice within a 15 minute period, when enabled, they will basically bypass your option right here, which for right now it's set to none. So no one should be able to call me, but obviously if they meet this requirement, they will bypass this option. So there we go. Now closing this off, whenever you want to enable your do not disturb mode manually, just find a toggle, tap on it and you're good to go. Now, also, once you're done with it, you can quick, quickly turn it off by tapping on it once again. And if you're also using the timer like I am, I can still turn it off before that timer runs out and this just won't trigger it again. So, which is pretty nice. Uh, the timer that I've set up, the four hour one, is just as a kind of like a safety net. If I forget to turn it off myself, it will just run for a couple additional hours most likely and then turn it off itself. But in any case, with that being said, hopefully you found this video helpful, and if you did, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.